What's up, guys, and welcome back to some more F122. Welcome back to the Cooper Motor headquarters. The team is hard at work, and uh, we are officially halfway through this first season, or at least we will be when we're done with this episode, with this race. So we are going to be heading to the Austrian Grand Prix today, the Red Bull Ring. It's going to be a lot of fun. Looking forward to that. I don't think we have too much time until then. We've got two days to work with. So we can either do second driver performance review, which is going to increase his focus, and driver promotion filming. We can do aero team building, or we can do a sponsor event, which is going to get us some team acclaim. I think, I think we do these two here. Looks good to me. Uh, in terms of facilities, we've got $3.36 million. I'm thinking what we're going to do is we're going to save up for the powertrain resource point generation upgrade for another $6 million down here. It's going to get us an additional 50 resource points every single week. So I feel like that's probably our, our best use. I mean, to be honest, I mean, like pit equipment isn't a bad idea. We've had troubles with pit stops. We could do pit. I've always talked about how we need to fire our pit crew and get somebody else. I, pit equipment really isn't a bad idea. The problem is, is these resource points. I mean, it's just every single week. It's, it's an additional 50 points. And I think over the course of a season, that's going to make a big difference there. But you know what? Screw it. Pit equipment, give it to me. Let's go for it. Whatever. Your boy makes decisions in the moment. So we're looking pretty good there. In terms of upgrades and stuff, our chassis, we should... Oh, this part failed. Okay. I remember that from the last episode. So for 648 points, we're going to guarantee that's going to be complete. We've got 530 left to mess with. Is there anything really small we could end up doing here? Maybe in, uh, in durability? No. Maybe in... No, there's nothing. Looks like over a thousand resource points is going to be pretty much all of our upgrades going forward. Got all the good good parts and things. Everything else is looking good. All right, here we go. Time to advance some time. There's not much to be able to do. We're just going to go straight into our race weekends. Okay, I'm going to go with the time. Oh, oh, you get a thousand. Wow. Okay, autocross gives you way more driver acclaim than the the timing does we got to keep that in mind. i thought they were all the same to be honest in the ferrari roma here baby let's see what we can do i haven't been in one of these haven't really seen these look at that giant digital gauge i don't know how i feel about that i feel like in some cars it looks pretty cool just all the technology and stuff that's becoming available but at the same time i kind of miss the old school analog gauges and things um this is a pretty simple track slow it down so I would imagine it's not going to be too tough on the, the autocross, but I think I think the, the gate placement is going to be where we might run into a few issues here. But we'll see. I'm going to start to slow it down here. To be honest, oh, yeah, slow, 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 and then hard deep inside. That's where they're trying to get you. I think we're about halfway done here. going to slow it down a little bit because it looks like we're going to the inside. Yes, sir. A lot of them are mainly on the racing line, but sometimes they, they get a little bit weird with the the back and forth. Get a little bit of gas, slow it down. I'm going to be honest, I feel like the autocrosses are typically the easiest ones. If you if you don't hit the, the bollards and you just honestly even kind of take it fairly easy, they almost seem to do themselves. See, this is where they're getting creative with it. Get around all these. Back to the inside. Looks like we've got some more slaloming happening here. Make sure you break enough for just coasts. Oh, yeah, dude. We killed it. Oh, oh, oh. Don't mess it up right at the end. There it is. All right. Beat it by a good 20 seconds. I think you're allowed to hit or miss a couple of the gates and still get a gold. We did well, though. That's going to get us 1,000 acclaim and $100,000. We'll take it. Our cash is getting pretty low. We may need to shut down facilities for a while to cut down our running costs. We're going to be fine. Your boy likes to run on the edge, baby. Here we go. So we are headed to Austria. Please tell me we don't have any drama. Let's just have a good race weekend. No drama, no bad weather, a full sunny race weekend. Every practice, the sprint race, the race, quali, everything. We've got a lot of racing ahead of us this weekend, so we're just going to hop straight into it. Here we go, baby. Let's see what we can do. Brake hard, come around through here. Try to carry some speed. Let's go, 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 go. Hit that DRS, yes sir. Using the full track, I'm gonna try to take it all, baby. Top of the hill, hard right. This is a tough corner. I love this track, dude. Get in there, get on the gas early. Beautiful, nice and clean. 
DRS. All right, we're hanging in there. Feel like the uh, middle part of the track coming up is is kind of where I typically either gain or lose all of my speed. Probably could have gone on the gas a little bit more there, but this this corner right here is always a lot of fun. That was clean. This one too. Nice and long. Stay on the gas. Yes, sir. Up at a P5, baby. What are we doing? All right, two corners left. Yo, my goodness. Woo, let's go, baby. Oh, that P5. Wow. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to go ahead and say it. I don't want to jinx it. But Austria and Canada are two of my favorite tracks to drive. So hopefully we don't get the uh, the Canada curse here. But uh, that that was solid, dude. I love that. All right, I'm feeling very confident in our car setup. I'm feeling confident about this weekend. You know what we haven't done is we've never dropped our fuel load in the uh, the sprint race. Okay. So we need five laps of fuel, plus we're going to be doing one lap of the, the preview. So I'm, I'm going to go with 6.2 laps. This could either be a really good or really bad idea. Wish we could skip the formation lap on the, the what's it called? The, the sprint race. It's just a lot throughout a weekend when you've got your practices, you've got your quality, you've got your sprint race, you've got your formation laps before the, the sprint race and the real race. It becomes a little repetitive. But hey, I should be taking this time to really get to know this track, get to know every square inch, you know, Body like a back road, baby. Driving with my eyes closed. I know every curve like the back of my hand, baby. I'm like Jordan, eyes closed on the free throw, right? We're doing 115 and a 30. We ain't got no worries. All right, that's that's enough of that. Y'all country fans? I like country. I don't know. I know a lot of people hate on country. I, I like grew up in Illinois, hip hop, rap, you know, top 40 was my everything. Still probably what I listen to most. But I, I like I like to throw some random genres in there now. And honestly, since I moved to Florida, country's a big one. I, I, I like country. I don't think you can live in Florida and not like country, really. But I think it's good music. You know, some some of it's not great, but I do like it sometimes. Ooh, Verstappen. That's going to be a bald spot on those tires, boy. Woohoo! Your boy has been on it. This is a scary start to a race. Just a straight line right into a right-hander. Here we go. Bit of a slow reaction. Bit of a slow start. Keep our overtake mode on. We're gonna drive this in around the outside. Let's go, 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 go. Overtake on, go, 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 push. We aren't as fast as the Red Bulls. Ooh, let's get in his slipstream. I'm still gonna try to go around. Outside, 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 outside. Oh, oh, oh. What happened? We got a warning. We got around Perez. Inside, 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 inside on Leclerc. Oh my goodness. <laughs> what a race. Oh my goodness. I hope we don't have too much damage though. We good, we're clear of Leclerc. All right, we can take the inside line. Where's our damage? We got a little bit of damage on the front right wing, but everything else is good, dude. That start was okay. Are you high, Jeff? Or whatever the heck your name is. You changed the name on me this, this year, and I don't know what's going on. That was a great start. We lost positions and gained them back. All right, here we go. I mean, we only went up one, I guess. That's probably why he's just saying it's okay, but I, that's pretty dang good to me. Whew, let's go. Si oh, we've got six laps on this sprint race. Okay, I guess it is kind of a, a slightly shorter track. So we're going to have three laps of DRS. We aren't going to have as much arrows, so just be careful on the corners and in the, the braking zones, Trev. DRS is going to be active next lap. I guess technically we'll have four laps of DRS then, huh? Let's just hang in there and, and do our thing. Holy cow. I mean, I hope that was all clean. Obviously, in the moment, your boy sees a gap and he's just shooting for it. I may have been a little aggressive there, but I'm hoping that was, that was okay. We really got to work on our race starts, man. I got to do some research on like what I should be looking for, for, you know, target RPMs and things like that. 
But for now, let's just focus on the, the race ahead of us here. Shoot. George is going to have DRS on us. We are not going to have DRS on Verstappen. Yeah, George is all over us, dude. Oh, come on. It's not even... I'm, I'm going to save my battery to, to fight the overtakes. I was going to say, we could try to, you know, extend past that second. And obviously, if we could get out of DRS range on him, that'd be good. It's not going to happen, though. He's, he's there and he's there to stay. Really, we just got to try to put in as good a lapse as possible and stop the bleeding where we can. That was not a good corner back there. Come on, Trev. Oh, we just got a warning on exceeding track limits. Okay. I was I was really trying my hardest to really push it, so we, we don't we don't want to do any more of that. Let's just play by the rules. There's a couple of corners that are kind of fun to push on this track, but I think we just lost our pushing privileges. We ain't we are not pushing P anymore. This one here. I like pushing this one wide and getting out here into the flats. I don't think we're really allowed to do that. See like that right there, that's pretty clean. That was good. Anything more than that, I think we're going to get in trouble. All right, two laps left. Let's just stay alive. Oh, that is not the view you want to have when you look behind you. Okay. Dude. Oh, God. I think we're going to lose our spot. I think we're going to lose our spot, man. And we could lose more than one. Oh, I'm nervous. Don't lose okay, gap ahead is seconds. the car. Do not lose the car. We almost lost the car back there. A little bit of little bit of battery there. Get us to this corner. Break. Come around through here. Break. Round through the last corner. Come on. Don't get too crazy. Some DRS or some ERS here. Okay, this He's half a second left. behind. We might be okay. A little bit through here. This is another passing opportunity. I'm actually going to use a lot of it through here. He's catching up. He's got that DRS wing open. That should be good enough. Stomp on the brakes. Let's go. This is another DRS zone. He might get us here. I'm going to try to use a little bit of ERS. Get us an early boost. There it is. Let's say the last 12% for that last straight. Protect the inside. Shoot. Tank's pretty much empty, but we're pretty much done. Going super wide there, Trev. No, you don't, George! No, you don't! Oh, my God! Leclerc's all over us, too! Come on! Oh! He bumped us wide! Hang in there! I'm waiting for the penalty for going wide. I don't think we had to go as wide as we did when he hit us. But I think we're... Dude, let's go. We gained a spot in the sprint race. We're going to be starting P4? Holy cow. That ending was terrifying. Okay, so we are... Uh we're going we're gonna to drop it to 19 laps of fuel. In terms of strategy, the undercut kind of worked for us last time. I think I might go for it again. We're going to pit on lap six. So we'll we'll try that. I mean, we were at a big disadvantage last time too with our uh, our setup. So I'm I'm happy with that. Here we go. Let's let's get after it. Formation lap. Let's get this car warmed up. Dude, look at us up here on the second row. That is insane. That is so exciting. Car looks good. Let's get her warmed up and uh, let's just hope and pray for a decent start. We got to not spin those tires, get down to that inside. Dude, this is, this track is one of the scariest starts in the game. I mean, you've got a, a fairly long straight into a hard right hander. It's not really that long, to be honest. So it's, I mean, the, the start is paramount here. Going around that right hander, going up the hill. You got to carry speed through there. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on, little girl. Let's go, baby girl. Oh, what a start. Let's go. All right, Hamilton comes over to cover off Verstappen. He opens up the inside for us. Verstappen goes wide. 
What just happened there? We're up in a P3. Overtake. I didn't even have overtake mode on. All right, we got it on now. Don't let Russell. Don't let Russell get you. I'm gonna try to protect the inside-ish outside. I'm. I'm just gonna swerve and protect the whole lane. You're not really supposed to do that, but we kind of just did. Not gonna lie. Here we go. Holy cow, we are getting dusted by Hamilton and Signs right now. We are up in the, in the top three. I don't know what we're doing up here, but we are here. Russell goes down the inside. Going to try to squeeze him off there. Going to keep our, uh, our ERS active. Trying to play fair and give him space. It looks like we may... I don't want to call that dirty... But we, I don't know, I don't know if we gave him a, a full, a full space right there. We'll, we'll see. Hopefully he's not too upset with us after the race. Going to be honest, we're going to have to have our fangs out here, dude. We are going to have to have our fangs out. So if we got to race hard, we got to race hard. It's about time we're owed some good luck. We've had some, some less than ideal luck the past couple of weeks. So being up here in third is amazing. I don't know if it's going to last, but we'll... We'll find out. It's going to try to use some of this battery, try to put as much space between us and him as possible. If we could somehow build up more than a second by the next lap so there's no uh, DRS for him, that'd be great, but I don't think that's going to happen. He's right on us. Not trying to use too much of our battery. Got to make sure we hang on to this for a rainy day. Maybe use a little bit in the straights just to give us a little speed boost. Okay, he's going to have DRS up this hill. He was within a second, so that's going to close the gap between us. But to be honest, the gap between him and, and Leclerc is surprising. Leclerc is not going to have DRS. So if we if we can stay ahead here for like a lap or two, that's really going to put a lot of space between us and Leclerc. And we might be able to settle into a P4, which is where we were qualified anyway. So that would make sense. He is all over us. Just trying to go around the outside. Not going to let that happen. Ooh, don't lose it. He might take the inside here. I shouldn't have left that open to him. Wheel to wheel. Looks like we might have had a little bit of contact there. I'm going to try to squeeze him wide. Use our ERS. Beautiful. Woohoo! We got some racing happening here, fellas. He's... Drive it deep, Trev. Drive it deep. Beautiful. Let's go. All right. Come on. Just porpoising my way down the, the straight here. Come on. Let's go. For some... You shouldn't have given the inside. Should have forced him outside. He's going to have DRS here. He's probably going to get you. I'm going to try to get back in front of him. Holy cow. Defend to the outside. I'm going to just kind of plant the car in the middle. It does look like Leclerc caught up. So my, my goal did not work. I'm basically just being a giant ham in the middle of the road here. Just blocking everyone up. Somehow your boy snuck up into the top three. Not a, uh, a great start for the rest of the squad out there. But hey, we're, we're trying to hang on, man. We're just, I'm, I'm out here doing my best. Oh my goodness. I mean, I, in an ideal world, they're, oh, look at them. Look at them fighting. I was just going to say in an ideal world, they're going to end up, you know, kind of getting into each other, possibly doing some damage, doing a lot of defending and attacking and things. And that's going to slow them down. Gave us a little bit of breathing room here. Whew. That is a scary lineup behind us there. All right, going to use a little bit of, little bit of uh of energy well that's good for him i'm nowhere to be found i'm four seconds behind those those guys i don't know how we ended up here i mean we qualified well we had a very fortunate sprint race we had a a good start to the race so i guess i do know how we got here but still it's kind of kind of insane series of fortunate events for us are we pitting on lap six? I may not pit yet. Or should we? Should we still go for the undercut? Or should we try to stay out here and protect our, our spot? 
I honestly, from a strategy perspective, that's why I'm so excited for F1 Manager 22, because we're actually going to be able to learn more of the ins and outs and things. I think I'm just going to go with our normal strat. It worked well for us yesterday. Let's not put our tires in the grass, Trev. Going to use some battery here, try to make sure they don't get us on the uh, second DRS segment of the track. Should be good. Got to start harvesting that a bit, though. We don't want to get too too low on the old, the old boost button, overtake button. How much do we want to bet that our pit crew is going to end up messing this up somehow? Who wants to take that bet? Come around through here. Make sure you break in time. Whew. We need a good stop. Let's get our optimal turn in time. Nobody else came in with us. We might be a little bit early. 0.3 seconds. Let's go. Don't mess this up. Don't go over the white line. If we get out here and potentially get some DRS opportunities, that's going to be massive. We're 1.7 seconds behind Latifi. Use all of our battery to get up to him. If we can DRS train, oh, we got to catch him. We got to catch him. Come on, come on, come on. We're 1.9 now. Dang it. We got to get these tires warmed up. But if we could somehow end up DRS training, that could be huge, but then again, they might slow us down because they are the back markers. I don't, I don't know what, what the play is here, but I, I hope it's, it's good news for us. I'm just gonna try to race as hard as I can here, and we'll hope for the best. I'm gonna use more battery. I do feel like that was a little bit early on the, the pit stop. Has anyone else gone in yet? Looks like we've got one, two, three in the pits. We're not quite in DRS range, but we will be. We're gonna be in DRS range now. Got it, let's go. Dude, this this could be the best race we've had. We need to get around the TV here. Overtake mode, DRS. Shoot, I don't think we're going to be able to get him on the straight. All right, I'm going to start charging. That DRS zone really does not do a whole lot for us. Come on, we just got to get in the slip and maybe try to... I mean, can we like try to go around the outside here? It's Latifi, dude. Maybe the inside? Outside. Outside it is. Outside it is. Let's go, 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 go. Use our battery, push him wide, push him wide. He's gonna have to go in the pits. I don't know what he's doing on the outside here. Woo, weaving through the traffic. Let's go, baby. Go, 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 go. We didn't get any DRS there. I was hoping we were gonna have like some sort of a DRS detect point. Come on. We're up at a sixth. Oscar's still out, signs, I, some people must have go, not gone out or not gone in yet. Latifi and Oscar definitely have it. Team orders, Oscar, get back here. I'm, I'm the, the team owner. Get back here, give me DRS, and then get the F out the way. Give me a toe. I mean, we do have good news in that, that Latifi is behind us and he's in front of Russell. He's kind of slowing Russell down a little bit here, so that's good news. We were in front of Russell before the pit stops. Come on, baby. Oscar's still staying out. What is Oscar doing? Joe Guan Yu is up in front of us. Dude, oh my goodness. I think we might be in fourth or maybe even third place. Russell's gotten around Latifi or Latifi probably went in the pits. We need to get within DRS range. We have really messed up not getting in DRS range yet. I'm most curious about what what our teammate's strategy could have been today. Does, is he starting on mediums? I think he started on mediums. Interesting. I think, hold on, I think my cat, Bella. I thought my cat was in the blind, but she's not. Okay, um, this is dangerous, we're good. There needs to be a DRS detection point right there so we get DRS. Oh, it is, it is. Oscar actually did what we needed him to. Let's go. 
That's gonna put us up at a P3 between or behind Signs and Hamilton. Let's go, dude. Keep freaking drive that. That might be enough to let us keep this. We need to make sure that we stay. Okay, gap ahead is 4.4 seconds. Out of DRS range for Russell. That was way too deep of a corner right there. We're two seconds ahead of Russ. Come on, baby. 1.9. We, we just got to... We might be able to get a podium here. I, I will lose my mind. That bit us, you know, but like bided us time. That gave us a little... You gotta drive it though, Trev. Can't be caught talking, you gotta race. That gave us a little bit of extra time. It's gonna give us a couple extra laps, but there's a lot of racing left here. So let's see little sp splints of, little little spurts of, of our energy along the straights. And let's just see if we can hold off George and hope there's no safety cars or anything ridiculous. I'm watching the timetables here. He's gaining on us in the straights. But I think we, uh, we've got a bit of an advantage in the turns. So we just need to make all the turns worth it and be smart about our battery usage. It looks like he might be gaining a 10th or two per lap though. So I don't know. We'll see 1.7. Come on, Trev, get wide here. Turn it in. Keep her fast, keep her fast. Use the whole track, whole thing. Use that, that little off-ramp thing, still 1.7. It's going up. It's going up, 1.8. Brakes, run a little bit wide if you have to, come in. Dude, I think we might've gained a little time on that lap. We might be cruising for a podium right here, but we need basically no mistakes and we can't have any safety cars. You've lost some time to the car behind. Don't tell me that. That's not good. Oh, uh, we were down to 1.8, so we gained, a, ooh, 1.9. Okay, we're, we're still hanging in there. I, I, that was not my cleanest lap back there, dude. We've got five laps left, please. Seconds. We're not catching them ahead, that's for sure. Holy cow, we just lost a ton of time in that corner. All right, I'm, I'm gonna be quiet. I'm just gonna focus. I'm just gonna focus. I'll see you guys if anything happens, but when I start talking, we we need this. I need this. We, we, we deserve this. I think our tires are fading. I think we're pushing beyond what our car can do. I don't think we're going to be able to hold out, but we'll see. Dude, he's down to 1.1. He's going to have DRS any minute now. He's going to have DRS any minute now. Just try try to stay out of it, especially on this straight up here. I'm going to use a little bit more battery. Don't, don't let him get within one by the detection point. Oof. Not good there. Use a little bit more. Yes, I know, but we also need to make sure that we don't let him get in DRS range because he's going to eat our lunch. Oh, we're going back up. We're going back up. Okay. Oh, my goodness, dude. I'm nervous. I really need Verstappen. I don't know what happened to Verstappen. He must have a little bit of damage. I need him to start getting in Russell's teeth and, and you know, disrupting his race a little bit down to 1.2 again. Come on, baby. Three laps to go. Three laps. He's starting to gain a little bit more time in that middle ground, but we're good. Oh my God. Two to go. Don't go too light wide on that one. That, that sausage curb will mess your under tray up. I think we might be okay. I, I think we might have it. I think it's definitely ours to lose. Do we, I think, wait, 2.3, what happened? Oh my God, what happened? Did they get into it back there? They had to have, they had to, we just lost a little bit of ground right there. You don't want to squeal the tires. We squealed the tires coming down the hill. 1.9, I mean, their mistake, you know, let me make my mistake and we're okay. We're gonna get a podium. 
One lap to go. We've got a 27% charge. We're going to get a podium. Come on. Come on. Good final corner. One lap to go. Use your DRS or your ERS down the straight. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Dude, I am in my own freaking zone right here. Seven seconds behind second place. Taking everything of that corner. We're, we're still gaining time. I think they're getting into... Oh, nope. He's off on his lonesome. I think they might have gotten into a little quarrel. Let's be careful with it. You just got to bring it home. Just got to bring it home, baby. Here we go. I cannot believe it, dude. Just take it easy, Trev. Well, I do like this part of the track. Let's, let's not let... Good thing we've only got about 60% of a lap left. Let's not let him catch us and even think about DRS if we can. I'm going to use some ERS here. We freaking did it. He cut it down to one second right here too. It's under a second. He was hunting. I wonder if he was DRS or ERS harvesting, but we freaking did it, dude. Race to the finish. He's going to have DRS there, but we got it. Our first podium. And we had to fight so hard for that thing. Everything had to fall in line. We had our best qualifying we've ever had. Super significant sprint race. Fortunate sprint race. I really feel the track layout combined with the track temperatures we saw today. Dap it up, signs. These cars come alive when the tires are just at the right temperature. And the driver did a great job Dude. managing that as well. They just look so... Here come our winners now. A thrilling race and a tremendous effort by Ferrari. I just don't even know what to say. Look at us up there on the podium with Hamilton and signs, dude. Oh my goodness. I mean, I we drove our heart out for it. I think we got very fortunate in a few different circumstances. But we were we were out there, dude. We need to enjoy this. Let me pick up my Ten thousand dollar bottle of champagne and just spray it all over the place. Lewis, get me, bro. Don't look at these two legends just ignoring me. Anybody get in me? Lewis is getting the crowd. I straight up got ignored on the the podium, dude. That's whatever. All right, our first podium. Very, very, very exciting day. How do we end up doing? Uh, I'm gonna say that replay for sure. Dude, George and I have been kind of fighting over this sixth spot here in the uh, the driver's standings. I guess Valtteri's pretty cr close too. That was huge for me right there. That gave me a, a solid a solid lead. It's uh, seven points. It's not the biggest in the world. I don't think we're going to be che catching Checo, but still pretty good. Charles is up top. Sainz is one point behind. Max is 10 behind that. Constructor's standings. That's going to bring us up into the fourth spot. Wow. Dude. Stoked. Stoked to say the least. That was one of the most intense race weekends I have ever seen. We absolutely cleaned house against Pierre there. Got both of our sponsor bonuses. Things are looking good. So hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to see you guys in our next episode. Oh my goodness, my hands hurt. I need I need to go take a break. That was a lot. Uh, contract renewal. Yeah, let's, uh, let's renegotiate. Piastri has not agreed to negotiate with your team for a seat. He needs point zero three million dollars. Point zero PS You're really you're really gonna back out on us, dude. I've invested so much money in you. Okay, we're gonna have to deal with this this fire next episode. I, I don't even know what to say. This is not good. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.